नमस्ते एंड वेलकम बैक टू माई YouTube चैनल एंड निवेदिता तिवारी योर एक्सलेंट स्ट्रैटेजिस्ट विद 14 डेज ऑफ डी क्लटर डिसम्बर आई होप दैट नाउ यू हैव डी क्लटर्ड फ्यू वेरी इंपॉर्टेंट एस्पेक्ट्स ऑफ योर लाइफ बोथ योर माइंड एंड अराउंड योर फिजिकल बॉडी फॉर द अपकमिंग फिफ्टीन डेज वॉट आई वुड रेकमेंड इज दैट यू शुड पिक एरियाज विच यू थिंक नीड सम मोर अटेंशन एंड अ बिट मोर फोकस so that you can really really declutter them in entirety what happens is that sometimes uh, some areas of our lives require much more attention and we might have to come back to them and you know pay more attention to them declutter them again with a lot more sincerity with a with a greater focus and with more intention and love so i would recommend like uh, you know i'm going to specifically pick week 2 and I'm going to repeat some of the exercises that I talked about and I'm going to get get rid of some of my memories some of my habits and you know I'm going to come back to them and I'm going to repeatedly do them over the next 15 days so that I feel more empowered to enter 2020 so this is how I do declutter december however uh, I did not talk about very obvious things because I thought they are very very obvious and you know you might have already done them or you may already know about them but today since it's declutter Dis uh, december closure i would just like to briefly mention them when i talked about physical spaces around you a uh, few areas which are really really important to declutter are where you cook your meals so kitchen and you know uh, anywhere you cook anywhere you prepare your meals becomes a very important area for you to declutter because what you eat is primarily what you are and a lot of times the kind of thoughts that you get the kind of behavior that you adopt a lot of it is inspired by the kind of diet you have <clears throat> so that is another important aspect of your physical uh, surroundings that you need to declutter uh your areas where you clean up areas uh, where you store most of your stuff so store rooms washrooms and yes the entrance to your place so you know the kind of feeling that you should get and others should get when they first enter your house uh, that should also be paid attention to because it's always about the vibe that you get when when you enter a place that sets you in the mood to uh, you know do a particular thing or be a, be in a certain uh, certain way in that particular place so make sure that you are giving yourself and other people the right kind of vibe the harmonious peaceful loving welcoming vibe when you or the others enter into your house so these are very very minute areas uh, which now you can declutter in the upcoming 15 days and remember to come back to any day uh, which you thought that you need to repeat and you felt a connection to because whatever we feel a connection to means that that is the work that we will grow doing so come back to ex uh, such exercises like i'm going to uh, you know definitely repeat some exercises related to my memories and related to my habits related to my thoughts and coming ba uh, coming out of autopilot i do repeat these exercises quite often so i'm going to come back to them so with that uh, i <laughs> it was a very beautiful experience for me sharing my week letter december rituals with you all so it's pretty um, difficult saying bye but since i am your excellent strategist and coaching is uh, you know my life purpose i will definitely come back with another set of rituals with another set of exciting exercises so that you and i can both be empowered to live our best life So a lot of love, a lot of light. Have a very very happy December and even a happier new year. But I'm not going to wish you that because new year is still 15 days ahead. I'm going to see you before that. Bye-bye.